Hello everyone, you're on the 100 Years of Sport channel, and today I'll tell you about an athlete whose name's been associated with the brightest and most memorable moments in the history of alpine skiing for many years. Tina Mays not only managed to reach the heights in these challenging and demanding disciplines, but also left an indelible mark in the hearts of millions of her fans around the world, becoming an embodiment of inspiration for many young athletes. However, Tina May stands out not only for her sports achievements, her contribution to the development of alpine skiing, as well as her active participation in social life, show her as a person of broad interests and deep social responsibility. And today, I'll tell you about Tina Mays' life journey, from her early years to the moment of becoming an icon of world sport, as well as her life outside the sports arenas. But before we begin, I want to remind you that there are already many interesting videos published on the channel, which are collected in a convenient playlist. Tina Mays, the future star of world alpine skiing, was born on May 2, 1983, in the Slovenian town of Slovenj Gradec. From an early age, Tina showed an interest in skiing and snow, which isn't surprising considering that her native region's famous for its ski resorts. Her parents quickly noticed their daughter's passion for skiing and supported her desire to pursue sports professionally. From the first steps on skis, Tina demonstrated outstanding abilities and a drive for perfection. Her training was filled not only with physical exercises but also with meticulous work on skiing technique, which became the foundation of her future success. Already in her youth, Mays began to show herself in national and international competitions, winning medals and taking prize places. Her transition to professional sports was a logical step after demonstrating impressive results in the youth category. Joining the Slovenian national team opened up new opportunities and challenges for Mazi, her debut in the World Cup, the most prestigious series of competitions in alpine skiing, took place in 1999 in Maribor when she was 15 years old. Mays's first landmark victory in the World Cup occurred in 2002 when she took first place in the giant slalom at the season opener in Solden. Interestingly, this performance became the first in the history of the World Cup when three athletes shared the first place. Tina shared her triumph with Austrian Nicole Hosp and Norwegian Andrine Flemen. This success not only bolstered her confidence in her abilities, but also made her perform even more energetically. She finished the season in 38th place, and at the 2003 World Championship, she reached the fifth line. In the same year, 2002, she debuted at the Winter Olympics in Salt Lake City, where she finished 12th in the giant slalom. But this only spurred Tina on. Over her career, Tina Mays won the World Cup three times. She stood on the World Cup podiums 81 times, 26 of which were victories. One of Mays's most significant achievements is winning the overall World Cup in alpine skiing in the 2012-2013 season, when she set a record by scoring 2,414 points for the season. This is the highest result in the history of alpine skiing competitions among both men and women. In October 2013, Mays was awarded the Ski Ador Prize by members of the International Association of Ski Journalists for her record-breaking performances thus becoming the first Slovenian skier to be honored with this award since its establishment in 1963. Also, Tina's one of seven female racers who've won in all five World Cup disciplines, and one of three to do so in a single season. In addition, she won four Olympic medals, two silvers at the Vancouver Olympics in Super G and Giant Slalom, and two golds at the Winter Olympics in 2014, in Giant Slalom and Downhill. The gold medal in downhill was Slovenia's first gold medal at the Winter Olympics in the country's history. Moreover, Mays has nine world championship medals, four of which are gold. In May 2015, Mays took a break from her career and didn't participate in any races for the season. During this time, the athlete completed her education at the Faculty of Education at the University of Maribor and obtained a degree as a primary school teacher. On October 20, 2016, in the Austrian Solden, Tina Mays announced the end of her career in alpine skiing. Her last performance was participation in the giant slalom on January 7, 2017 in Maribor, exactly where she debuted in the World Cup stage in 1999. Tina Mays, one of the most successful alpine skiers in history, has had a significant impact on the popularization of alpine skiing, not only in her native Slovenia, but also beyond its borders. Her achievements on the international stage and activity outside sports have contributed to the growth of interest in alpine skiing among young people and adults. In Slovenia, Mays is considered a symbol of sporting mastery and national pride, for which she was awarded the Medal for Merits in 2009 and the Golden Order for Merits in 2013. Her successes have inspired many young Slovenians to take up alpine skiing and have strengthened interest in winter sports in the country. 
After ending her professional career, Tina didn't step away from sports. On the contrary, she began actively working with young people as a coach in her own team, Almaze, which was created back in 2007. The athlete uses her experience and knowledge to train young skiers, sharing with them the techniques and strategies that helped her achieve success. The athlete's known for her positive attitude towards life and sports. She often emphasizes the importance of goal-orientedness, hard work, and belief in oneself as key components of success not only in sports but also in life in general. Her personal philosophy and attitude towards overcoming difficulties serve as inspiration for many people around the world. However, Tina's known not only for her sports achievements, she also loves music. Since childhood, the athlete has played the piano, and in 2012, she released the single, My Way Is My Decision. With the help of Slovenian producer Raje, the song became more danceable and immediately topped the popularity ratings in Slovenia, displacing the global hit by Adele from the leading positions. Now, Tina Mays lives in the north of Slovenia in the town of Črna na Koroškem, where, together with her husband and, concurrently, the coach of the Amaze team. Andrea Massi, she's raising a daughter born in February 2018. Otherwise, Tina Mays tries to keep her personal life away from the public eye. Tina Mays has not only achieved incredible heights in her career, but also made a significant contribution to the development of alpine skiing, setting an example for future generations to follow. She rightfully occupies a special place among the greatest athletes in history, thanks to her indomitable spirit, talent, and contribution to sports. Her name will forever be inscribed in the annals of sports history as an unchanging symbol of success, unwavering resilience, and tireless pursuit of perfection. If you like this video, I'd appreciate your support. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss even more interesting stories. Don't forget to leave your likes, which help identify what you really like and guide me in the right direction. Your comments are also very important. I value your opinion and I'm always happy to discuss the presented topics. Your feedback helps me grow and improve so that each new material is even more interesting. Join our community right now. Here we talk about sports.